<laughs> Hi, Math 212 students. I'm going to go over how to use a graphing calculator to find the values where two curves intersect, and then find the area between the two curves. So this is chapter 15.5, number 25. Okay. All right. Come on. Turn on. Y equals. So let's put in e to the x and negative x squared minus 2x. I'm just going to go zoom 6. Zoom, then I just hit number 6 for standard. Okay, I'll have to zoom in. So let me try zoom 4. Yeah, good enough. So second calc intersect, number 5. Is that my first curve? Yeah. Is that my second curve? Yeah. What's my guess? Zero works. Okay, so here's my first intersection. Negative 0.41 and then 6.6. 6. Let me find the other intersection. 5. Is that my first curve? Yeah. Is that my second curve? What's my guess? How about negative 2? Okay, so negative 1.92 and 1. Oh, 0.15. So I'm going to put in, let's see, the one on the top was the curve with the x squared. So I'm going to put in, I need to say y2 minus y1. So if I come over here to variables, variables, just variables, sorry, I don't need second. y variables, the function y2 minus the variable, y variable, function y1, and I'll just go ahead and, uh, if I hit enter on the equal sign, then I'll have to graph it. So I'm just going to be concerned about this area right here, see if I can remember it. Okay, back to calc. Second calc. Number seven, the intersect, or the integration. Okay, that's what I need. Is this my function? Yes. Now the lower limit refers to how far to the left. So that was negative 1.92, I believe. And the upper limit, oh, I don't remember, so I'm just going to come down. What was it? About right there. Enter. And there's the area right there. I use the graphing calculator to find the uh, values of x where the curves intersect and then to find the area between the two curves. That's it right there.